Tonight, live at five, it is a big night at the new AcraSure Arena. Today, they held a ribbon cutting on the new arena with the Doobie Brothers, who will be playing tomorrow night. Tonight, the entertainment gets started with comedians Chris Rock and Dave Chappelle taking the stage. It's been a couple of years and hundreds of millions of dollars in the making. We have live team coverage for you tonight. Samantha Lomibau is standing by with a look at the fan experience and traffic and how that's going to work tonight. And we begin with News Channel 3's Marion Bouchot, who was there for the ribbon cutting this morning. Marion. Hey there, John. So honestly, it's, it was a huge morning, and right now it's kind of the, the quiet before the storm. We don't have crowds coming in quite yet, but they're coming. Right now, this is what we have going on. We have uh, Aperture Arena crews right here. It looks like it's the security team getting ready for those crowds that are going to be coming in for tonight's show, and the fun is just beginning because with the ribbon cutting this morning and now heading into tonight's first show of the Aperture Arena, this is no soft opening. The official opening of the Acrisure Arena marks the start of a new era in the Coachella Valley. This valley needed a place like this. This valley desired a place like this. And it took incredible courage. With several community leaders coming together to celebrate the milestone. As CEO of the Seattle Kraken, Todd Lewicki helped bring the arena's vision to life. Such a glorious, beautiful place, but there wasn't a place that we could all come and celebrate. Celebrate the Doobie Brothers, celebrate the music, the, com the comedy tonight, and celebrate a team. In addition, the Burger Foundation Iceplex welcomed its first ever ice skating exhibition, making it possible for the Valley community to take part in ice sports. In the hours leading up to Wednesday night's show, we got crews on scene finishing up those final touches, everything from cleaning to even loading up all the food and drinks for the concessions. This Valley has had the greatest golf, the greatest tennis, the greatest music festivals, and now it's going to have the greatest music concerts and, and family shows. Even though some parts of the arena are still under construction, arena officials are ready to welcome the crowds in. The great leaders of Riverside had the foresight not just to help us get this arena built, but at the end of the day to bring the first professional team into Riverside County, into Coachella Valley, and represent this community. CEO of the Oakview Group, Tim Lewicki, says the occupancy papers were handed just minutes before the ribbon cutting. Thank you for letting us be a part of your community, and we couldn't be more proud to wear that Coachella Valley on our uniforms each and every day. And tonight's show is set to start at 7.30 with those doors opening at 6 o'clock. So those crowds, they're going to be coming here soon. And at 6 o'clock, we'll also be coming at you live again, giving you updates as to how things are looking at in our outside of the arena with those crowds. Live in Palm Desert, Miriam Bouchot, News Channel 3. And we are just uh, two hours away until the arena's first show, kicking it off with comedians Chris Rock and Dave Chappelle. Our Samantha Lomibau joins us live right now. And Sam, how's it looking ahead of the big night where you are? Karen, definitely an exciting night indeed. Right now, not too many people right now. We could take a look at this parking lot. So this is the VIP area and the main parking lot. You can see a few cars trickling in, but in just a couple hours, going to be a completely different outlook. Now, some things to know if you are heading here to the Acrisure Arena, you can prepay for your parking. You can save up to 20% by doing so. That's about 32 bucks online, but you can also pay at this sign right here. You will be scanning a QR code. This is a cashless event. Now that goes for here parking and that also goes for inside the arena. So I scanned that QR code. You can take a look about what it looks like. That's what it'll look like. You can see the rate right there. It'll be 50 bucks though. If you are planning on paying here at the arena, you'll just type in your license plate, the state, and then as you can see, 50 bucks and you can buy with Apple Pay. Google Pay, Visa, MasterCard, everything that you can name. Again, a cashless event when you are getting here. Now, there are four driveways leading into this lot, the bottom two all the way at the end. Those are going to be for general parking. There will also be VIP parking at the entrance right around here and at the very front. That's dedicated to shuttles and ride shares. So be sure to look out for that. Now, if you aren't planning on coming to the arena and Varner is typically your way of coming home, my only advice to you tonight, try avoiding this area. Take alternate routes if you can. And as we all know, Cook Street construction also taking place. So plan a little bit of time ahead of your drive. And in just about two hours, that show is kicking off and we'll be talking with fans until then. And we'll check in back with you. Live in Palm Desert, Samantha Lebow, News Channel 3. 